Last week in LA, we were looking at audience. So we would take a paragraph and we would try to figure out who that author was writing to, who was that author's intended audience. This week, we're going to start with an audience in mind and then write a uh, piece of writing for that audience. So you can see uh, at the top it says, uh, when we're writing, it's important to think about the audience that you want reading your message. You're gonna look at this picture here of this school bus. You're gonna make a short piece of writing so that writing can be a, a paragraph, a letter, or a poem. Um, and I want it to discuss this picture in some way. So it needs to describe the picture or tell about something that's important when it comes to this picture. Um, before you start writing, you're gonna decide the age of your intended audience and if the writing is going to be formal or informal. Now, I'm gonna leave this up to you. If we were doing in class uh, this assignment, I would give you, uh, you guys, all different audiences to write for, but since we're doing it from home, I'm gonna let you pick your own audience. The second page is where you uh, decide on audience. So I wanna know what is the age of the people you want to speak to with this piece of writing. I want to know uh, what words you're going to use to target your audience. So what, ki what kinds of words? Uh, if, it's, if you're talking to adults, you're going to be writing much different types of words than if you're writing to preschool kids. Um, I want to know is your paragraph or piece of writing, remember it can be uh, a letter or a poem also, is it going to be formal or informal? So are you going to make it formal, so it would be like serious, and, uh, and very professional, or is it gonna be informal? Is it gonna be very casual and just speaking to someone just like you would talk? Uh, and I wanna know what you're going to do to make that tone formal or informal, whichever one you've, choose, you've chosen to do. Um, your rough copy can go on uh, the next page and make sure it has a title and your name on it. Um, you can print off this page and write it by uh, hand for me, or you can type it directly into this uh, document. That's, uh, that's your choice. All right, guys, um, by Tuesday, I would like your rough copy uh, handed in to me, and then I will look over it and return it to you by Wednesday, and then your good copy is due uh, at the end of the week. All right, guys, good luck. Let me know if you have any problems. Thanks.